Hello everyone. Uh, lip stick in my teeth. No, that's always a win. I feel like every time I stream, every time I do YouTube, I like always feel like I have lipstick in my teeth. So, and I normally do. I actually did a stream once. I did the whole stream and I had lipstick in my teeth. So I tried to remove that bad boy from demand so no one ever knew about it. But guys, welcome back to one of our last Vlogmases, which is really exciting. I'm gonna be real with you guys. I'm still not feeling Christmassy. Let me fill you in because I know a Vlogmas went out yesterday, but there has been a few days gap since I've posted. So I'm gonna fill you guys in on everything that's been going on. And we're gonna get into quite an exciting Vlogmas today for as much time as we have. Your girl is running out of time, but for as much time as we have, we're gonna have a very exciting vlogmas today. So the last time you guys saw me, I did actually go home for the weekend. I went back to my parents, um, we had like a Christmas meal, then we had some Christmas drinks, and my mum made me down like the most disgraceful like drink I've ever tasted in my life. And then the next day, we just had a really nice chill day. We watched the Avengers Endgame um, at my parents and stuff like that, then we drove back. And when we got back, we had such a good tidy of the apartment. Oh, it was amazing. Like everything is immaculate. Everything is unpacked. There's a few things in the wardrobe room that aren't, but they, I need hangers. And it's like 30 quid for a pack of hangers, which has made me so happy because I think that was partly why I wasn't feeling too Christmassy, just because we haven't fully finished moving. And in our defense, we moved at the busiest time ever. We moved at the end of October when I was actually part of a secret project, which I still can't tell you guys about. You will find out soon, but I can't tell you guys yet. But I was part of a secret project. I uh, was wrestling every weekend. Danny's wrestling every weekend. Danny had like a full week of wrestling. Danny also works a full-time job. I work a job. I do my YouTube, I do my Twitch. So like a million and one things were happening in October and we also moved and we moved really last minute so getting furniture and everything like that was just stress it really really was but i did actually vlog all of that journey so if you guys haven't checked that out and you are interested you can go and see that and then we will be picking back up with the moving kind of vlogs in january because we've actually been having a little look online and like that evening we actually looked online after we like cleaned up and we kind of like have looked around for bits and pieces that we're going to get in the new year just to kind of decorate i guess because i feel like it's furnished right now but it's missing the touches that make it our home so that's just something we needed to get to because by the time we got the main bits it was christmas and then it's like the focus was on christmas decorating and presents and a million and one other things vlogmas so yeah we we've, we've, we've made a lot of progress everything's really clean everything's unpacked apart from a few bits in the wardrobe room but it actually looks like a room now before it was like a pile of clothes now it is actually quite a, a nice place to be so yeah i'm really really chuffed with that and i just needed and then the next day i just cleaned more and just organized everything and just had a day for me which was really nice because i feel like i just haven't had any time for myself we just watched a couple of marvel films yes i'm absolutely obsessed with marvel now that's a thing i love it i knew it was coming ages ago like when i was younger i really wanted to watch all of the series and i started getting really into it and then i think i had like exams or something but I'm back again and I'm obsessed, but it's nice. I feel a little bit cozy and Christmassy. I'm not 100% there, which is really bad because what is it today? It's the 22nd of December and I'm still not 100% Christmassy, which is like really concerning. I just spent the morning watching Vlogmases whilst I was getting ready. I watched like a couple of different people's Christmassy videos some Vlogmases, things like that. And I'm not there yet, I'm not there. So I'm gonna put the Christmas lights on I'm gonna just kind of do my hair. I did actually wash it yesterday. Like it should be really fluffy. Like it should be quite nice. It looks kind of horrendous right now. Um, but basically, yeah, I look like a lion and oh my God, is it wet? It smells so good. It smells like this conditioner I use. It's the LV like one for if you have, um, like it basically is meant to like moisturize your hair more or less. We've got a lot of work to do. I thought the hair would be a really quick and easy process, but it's not gonna be. So basically my plan for today, Danny has gone to the shops to go and get some food in. And then he's so gracefully gonna cook for me because I have 45 minutes until my marathon. So over on Twitch, I am doing a marathon today, an eight hour marathon. I'm doing a giveaway. It's really, really exciting. I'm gonna play a lot of multiplayer games and then play obviously the usual Animal Crossing and Pokemon. I have 45 minutes until that point. So I need to sort my hair out. Danny is gonna cook. And then I also wanted to wrap my presents for you guys today. So I'm gonna shut up. I'm probably gonna run the hairdryer on this because basically last night, I did a full routine. I did the shave, exfoliate, tanning. Even though I look quite pale right now, I think it's just the lighting. I did a full routine. I shit you not, at 3 a.m. 
I did like all of this. I blow dried it. It was dry, but I feel like, you know, when you like put your hair up at night and you've washed it the night before, I feel like it does always feel a little bit like like a tiny bit damp it smells gorgeous it's probably still got conditioner in it to be honest because that conditioner never really washes out that well so like the bottom of my hair is always like super soft but also this kind of feels a tiny bit wet so i'm gonna go and fix this and then we are hopefully gonna wrap our presents and i feel like i'm gonna have to start my stream and eat on stream because i'm running out of time time is absolutely flying today because when i was watching the vlogs i was getting ready i wasn't just like sitting there like ah. I was doing my nails, I started doing my makeup, and I was just like, where is the time going? Because I'm super quick with getting ready too, so I just don't know where the day has gone. I just feel like, time is flying! I'm gonna wrap the presents today, that has to happen, so let's go. And also, this is my little outfit for today, so I have my little Shein angel top on, I have my Opoly joggers, and then I just have my little Ugg slippers on. This is for my Santa shoe, and that's why there's round of me, just like a belt and headband on the floor. I have my little Santa outfit because I'm going to do a shoot and post it on um, Christmas Eve or Christmas Day, I'm sure. And then I've just put my little tree on, so I'm hoping to get some festive energy. And then here are presents. I don't know if my family watched my vlogs, so I'm going to kind of cover that, but I will be wrapping those in a minute, so we'll get to that. But yeah, let's sort this hair out first. Rudolph, how you do that? I'm basically gonna, this is so weird, people are gonna think I'm really strange. I'm gonna straighten it and then curl it. That sounds really weird, but basically like these wavy bits from where it was kind of probably a bit wet when I went to bed, I'm basically gonna straighten it and then I'm just gonna curl the bottom. I'm not doing a full curl today, but I don't like it when the ends are just straight. So when I do have time, I like to just curl, put curl on the bottom. Then I'm gonna wrap my presents in half an hour. That's definitely totally 100% gonna happen. Also today I was meant to do the Santa shoot, but basically I've got the eight hour marathon and for the Santa shoot, I'm doing like big curly hair and like red lips. And I just think it would, I would have to like keep basically fixing my makeup throughout the stream because it's red lip. I did wear red lip on Saturday and it stayed on so well. I had the Huda Beauty like, one that comes like a, almost like a lip gloss. It's like a matte lip gloss, which was amazing. But yeah, I just feel like eight hour stream, red lipstick. It's not the one. Like if you know you're going on a big night out, for example, you don't wear red lipstick sort of thing. I would equate it to that. <laughs> and also I just feel like the eight hour marathon, I feel like so done up just sitting in there. I am the glamour though. So, you know, I guess it works. But yeah, I put that on tomorrow because I don't have a busy day tomorrow. So it will literally just be the shoot, the stream and just last minute sort of Christmas preparations, which I will be vlogging. So yeah, and obviously I've got a bit of editing to do and things like that, just a bit of work to get done just before kind of taking Christmas Eve and Christmas Day off. I will be vlogging on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, like I'll be filming bits and pieces here and there, but I obviously won't edit it until probably the day after Boxing Day. I mean, I'm meant to have a show. I'm a bit worried with COVID and lockdown about if that show is gonna go ahead. It's supposed to go ahead. And we already wanted to go ahead, but obviously if Boris changes the rules, then it won't. So I'm literally touching wood right now that that goes ahead because I'm really looking forward to that. So yeah, I've got that. I've got a show on the 27th. So I'll be vlogging it all. Um, it's just in terms of editing it, it will be out probably on the 28th kind of thing. Um, it will just depend on lockdown and how things go and stuff like that. But I'm definitely vlogging it all, so don't worry. That will be in there. It's just if I get time to edit it. So I popped out to go and get the Christmas sort of last bits and pieces. So I just got these gift tags from W. Smith. They're absolutely gorgeous. I got three packs of six. So I don't feel like that's enough because basically for Blake, I bought loads of little bits and pieces. And then for my mum, she's got quite a few little bits and pieces, but Blake's got the different wrapping. So I feel like I don't need to gift tag it. And then all the boys just have like one main gift. And then Danny, <sighs> Danny's gift. So I've got all of his gifts, which is such a big relief. That's something I did on my day off. Like I just sat down. I say it was a day off. I did work as well, but 
I kind of just did things that I just haven't had time to do because with doing vlogmas and streaming all the time and stuff I'm constantly like on 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 and ready and filming and stuff like that and it's just that sort of admin side I haven't had too much time to really sink my teeth into so I just kind of use that day to just get on top of my list so that going into Christmas I can enjoy those two or three days and just like look at me like debate working on boxing day um just enjoy those two or three days off so I ordered Danny, Danny's gifts and they've all said they've been delivered. Obviously I've sent them to my mum's because I didn't want to send them here. Uh, so I do need to check with her and just check that he's got everything. But I'm just going to wrap his probably at my mum's. I'm hoping I have leftover paper, but if not, he's probably going to get like happy birthday paper or whatever my mum has in. So yeah, I hope these will be enough tags. I think they will. But we basically got everyone. So yeah, let me sort my hair out quickly. And then I need to do a middle part. A middle part is no easy feat when you don't have a mirror this is actually just a phenomenal point i'm trying to use the little mirror like the camera like screen thing <laughs> is this even i don't even know i'm just gonna basically quickly run over all of this and then maybe back comb it put some curls in the bottom all of this hey all of this work I literally stayed up till three last night, quickly getting ready after my stream, and here I am, super behind. I feel like I've basically got most of it. I'm gonna pop my curlers into heat up and whilst I do that, I'm just gonna go and just sort out this bit in the proper mirror because it's not a world where I'm getting this done in here. But look, look, I already look so much better now that I've sorted my hair out. Here is the finished result. Basically, I want to quickly add some volume in, but I feel like that's the longest it's ever taken me to ever get ready in my life. So let's go and have a little look at the time. Yay, Christmas tree, Christmas, Christmas vibes, Christmas energy. Okay, so Dan said bang the kettle on five minutes ago. Right, that's for my pasta. And I have not done that, so. Has I got? Oh, and I had a tea this morning and I forgot about it, it went cold. So that for me was the omen for the day. That's like how the day is going. That's the kind of day I'm gonna have. So I have not had my advent calendar today. I have the Heroes one, which I didn't have. I literally didn't eat up until the 17th. And then Danny and I were hungry one day and Danny and I ate all 17 at once, but I just popped. I literally have 24 minutes. 24 minutes till I go live. Has Danny ate my advent today? But well, we were just disgraceful. Like we literally ate those at once. Where's 21? Do I have time for this? 22, 24, 20. He's ate my advent! It's ringing. It's not answering. Do you know what? That probably means he's close. So if you want to fight me in person, we'll absolutely fight in person, right? It's 40 past now. So 40 past three, yeah. So I said I was going live at four. So I have 20 minutes. Well, actually probably 15. Good thing. Oh, oh. Hello. Did you eat my advent? Wait, hey, you said I could. I said you could have them when you were hungry that day. Not that you could eat my advent calendar. When I offered to buy you an advent calendar, you said no, you didn't want one. Yeah, but the chocolate in the house. So you ate my advent. And do you know what today's advent is? Do you want to know what today's advent is? What? A double decker. Yes. I'm breaking up with them. I also lost my um, nail scissors, which I'm so upset about. I can't even begin to tell you because I had like the most amazing little ABH like eyelashy sort of makeupy scissors. They're like good for cutting your eyelashes and just like little makeupy bits. I have to use these. 
to cut eyelashes that's small so my makeup my makeup my wrapping choices i have this lovely white bow with oh there he is you have to die. you ruined my christmas when i say i'm not in the christmas <laughs> spirit this is why yeah you my advent yeah it's a christmas shop what do you, what's the Christmas thing? You can do the Christmas favourite. You've shamed me on stream. I just don't want to talk to you. Right. Okay, I have 18 minutes. This is the most stressful, horrendous situation I've ever found myself to be in. I have to wrap Luke and Charlie's gift. Actually, lock my family's gift last because they're in the box that you are sat on. So I think I might start with Blake. So goodbye aesthetic wrapping paper, but I did find literally the best wrapping paper in the world. It is these unicorns and it's like a nice sort of pink, purpley blue like tie dye with little snowflakes on it, which I love because I find, I always wanted to do like something fun for Blake, but I feel like they're either fun, like, I don't know, like Disney themed or something, but they're not Christmassy. So I'm really happy I found this and it was all quite good prices. Like I've just been going to, local Christmas shops and markets and I've actually shopped locally a lot this year for Christmas stuff which I'm quite happy about in terms of like decorations, bits and pieces of the house, wrapping, um, I've just gone to like the smaller stores and little marketplaces and things like that so very pleased with that so I feel like I could show you Blake's gift but I'm just panicked that she's gonna be do you think Blake will watch my YouTube? Blake would accidentally fall onto it. She would like this is the thing but Oh, I got Blake so much stuff. I literally went out yesterday to get the tags and I ended up getting her just like even more stuff. And I need to go to Zoe's to grab. Um, Zoe's actually handmade her a gift from her store. I will link that down below if you guys haven't checked it out. Zoe handmakes a lot of different stuff. I don't want to say what it is because Blake, I feel like is watching me and judging me, but I got her to make something amazing, amazing, amazing. So I'm gonna go and pick that up tomorrow. So I do need to wrap that, but that's fine. That's just like a last minute thing. So what I'm basically gonna do, I think, is pop you guys onto a time-lapse and you guys, I'll show you the presents like after I've wrapped them, like as in each individual one, because I just feel like my family have never ever shown an interest in my YouTube, but today will be the day that they decide to check out my channel and just see all of their gifts, which, I've done really, really well this year. I feel like Danny and I have really nailed it on gifts this year and I don't want to spoil them. And Blake, I've got so much lovely stuff because we went out one night, we weren't even planning to get gifts and we went to the shop and we found so much amazing stuff she'll just love. And then yesterday I just saw a few bits that she would love. I, mean, I saw a lot of things she would love, but I just limited myself. But you know, being the, being the auntie that always brings presents is my job role now. But I limited myself because I just think I go crazy. And the thing is, where, where Blake's five, like last year, she just tore through gifts. Like she just, you know, and I feel like she just wants to unwrap lots of stuff. So I just went for like a lot of things that she would love and hope for the best. And I try to get things that like from smaller places so that like not everyone, cause she's got quite a big family, like not we always like get dupe barbie like we we'll both get the same barbies we both get the same poly pockets and things like that so i've tried to like avoid stuff like that so we she doesn't get duplicates because i remember i got something at christmas i got her like a few things at christmas and she unwrapped one of them she went mommy i already have this and i was like <laughs> it's like the, it's the worst feeling in the world but she has like literally like seven aunties so yeah i've tried to basically go for things that no one else will have so I'll see you guys on the other side. She gotta love this Christmas, but it ain't with me. I watch the snow falling down like it's Rack City. Back to my hometown, back to the whiskey. Back to texting all your exes on Xmas Eve. And I'll be there, yeah, I'll be there. With your hoops and your fucked up hair. And even though you got another man, you could put your bubble goose on my one night stand, yeah. Put up the lights there, like a snowman in my nightmares. Pine needles and marijuana in your hair, and I swear. 
These nights ain't they rough when December come around Tis the season of the cuff Keep my mind out the gutter Make food with extra butter Make do with something other than you Another lover so These reunions and black liver Fridays We lost in nostalgia If I had it my way I roll down the window of this Nissan sleigh Soup up everyone I never get to see these days Put the house party together Let the champagne rain Maybe the world's gone bad But the Hennessy ain't Maybe we all gone mad Maybe the news all fake But see the crew's all here, so let your homeboy paint I've been around these states, you know the red and the blue I know we all just trying to get through yeah. She gotta love this Christmas, but it ain't with me I watch the snow falling down like it's Rack City Back to my hometown, back to the whiskey Back to texting all your exes on Xmas Eve And I'll be there, yeah, I'll be there With your hoops and your fucked up hair And even though you got another man you could put your bubble goose on my one night stand yeah. You could put something new up into my lifespan Resolutions never holding, babe, I don't like plans I could lose a couple nights under these old street lamps I could do without the drama, hope my wish list lands We gon' sip the coffee in the morning With some Baileys up on it Like the rain coming down, I'm glad it ain't California Gets a little bit colder We could build us a snowman Put a blunt in his mouth and flip up the Toyota And we ride up to the mountains with the North Face on lounging No court dates or orange face a poor taste we out this good year reindeer under candy paint steering kissing joints under mistletoe feeling safe here ride till the wheels fall off this bitch or at least until december 26th i've been around these states you know the red and the blue i know we all just trying to get through she gotta love this christmas but it ain't with me i watch the snow falling down like it's rack city back to my hometown back to the whiskey back to texting all your exes on xmas eve and i'll be there yeah i'll be there with your hoops and your fucked up hair and even though you got another man you could put your bubble goose on my one night stand yeah you'll be gone in the morning so stay here for the I don't know how Santa does it to be honest with you. I even got Danny in to rap whilst at eight and then we were both rapping at the same time. We have one, two, three, four, four left, but I do have to go and stream. So I'm just gonna finish it afterwards or potentially tomorrow, but I'll show you guys what we've done so far. So they actually look really cute. It was a bit see-through. Do you mind? It was a little bit see-through, so some of them had to double wrap. They're all of Blake's and there's a few here and then we've just got a few more to do. So I'm gonna put pause in it now and I'm gonna wrap this vlog mess up here because I do have to go and do my Mariathon. And if you guys aren't following me on Twitch, it's twitch.tv slash X. We play a bunch of different games like Animal Crossing, Mario Kart, Pokemon, all that good stuff. And today we are doing a Mariathon. So I'm gonna go get myself set up for that. It's eight hours long. I needed to get energy drinks. I didn't get anything for this, but yeah. And then after that, I'm gonna finish the presents. And then tomorrow I have my little Christmas shoot. So I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Don't forget to drop a comment down below, like the video and subscribe. Bye. Gotta love this Christmas, but it ain't with me. I watch the snow falling down like it's Rack City. Back to my hometown, back to the whiskey, back to Texas.